outside of my jewelry armoire and it has a mirror on the front. So I have it hanging on the wall um, behind my door to my room and then there's a chair on this side and then that's my closet here. So it's on this wall here. And so I'm just going to go ahead and open it up. It's about that much away from the wall if you want to kind of imagine it. So this is what it looks like on the inside when you open it up. It's really big and I really love how it stores my jewelry. So I'm just going to start up here where my necklaces are. Um, as you can see there's hooks here and then there's a hook on the top and hook on the bottom. But I just have one necklace per hook. So um, I'm only going to mention stuff if I know where it's from. Um, the other things I might not necessarily know where it's from if it's older or if I got it as a gift. But this necklace here is from Forever 21 and it's just a long... Um, turquoise multi-layer necklace. Then I have um, this gold multi-layer necklace chain from Forever 21 as well. This one is from American Eagle. I got it as a gift and it doesn't have an odd in it but I tied it there just to give it more dimension when I wear it. Then this other long silver necklace is from American Eagle as well. It just has some pearls on it. Um, this one again is from American Eagle. No, wait, this one's from Forever 21. And it has some pearls and it's a bow, it's really pretty. This one here is from Forever 21 as well. A lot of this stuff is from Forever 21. So it just has some pink and gray and purple beads and it has like gold um, detailing. The next row, it's a little bit shorter than this top row, so I have all my super long necklaces at the top and then um, the last two rows of hooks are a little bit shorter and you can tell that these hooks are um, different these ones are just single hooks and there's more and they're like scattered up and down up and down so I'm just gonna start here in the corner so this one necklace well it's not really a necklace it's just a string of beads and I got this um, someone sent it to me from Africa and then this necklace, um, I want to say it's from like Urban Behavior or Sirens or something. I can't really remember. This silver one is from Forever 21. Then this gold necklace here. Um, it has a bird and a flower and a little um, crystal. This one is from Forever 21. This spike necklace with the black um, beads on it. I love this necklace so much and I wear it a lot. It's really edgy and I really like it. This one's from Forever 21. And then this little key um, necklace, which is gold. It's from Forever 21. This one's from Forever 21. You've probably seen me wear this one in recent videos because I got it pretty recently. And then this feather necklace is from... I want to say sirens or urban behavior, I think. So that's that row. Now I'm going to kneel down here and show you guys these necklaces. These are mainly silver necklaces. Um, this is a silver short chain necklace with a little cross that I got. And it has um, rhinestones on it. And I got this when I went to Quebec on a school trip. We went there for like a week. And I bought this in one of the... Um, churches that we went to go see and the priest there blessed it for me so that's really special then this is just a heart necklace um this one is from claire's a really long time ago it's hello kitty this one is from forever 21 it's an anchor this is from forever 21 i believe a long time ago i don't really wear that one too much but it's a big uh, flower pendant and then this i don't know where it's from but it's a little angel then down here there's like this little removable shelf and here I just keep um, my big chunky bracelets. This one's from Forever 21. Here I have some big chunky rings. Um, oops, that ring fell but it's just a silver one. And then I have my little C charm that I um, put on this silver, oh wait, this silver chain. Um, I alternate between this cross and the C. The C is for my boyfriend's name. Then. Um, here I have the Pandora watch. Now moving on to the other side of the door, the inside of the door. Up here it has some slots for some rings. So I keep rings and stud earrings here. So I have 
this big ring from Sirens. This one's from like Claire's a long time ago. It's a strawberry. This one I made myself. Let me focus on this one. I made this ring myself of, from like a little craft kit. And it's a bead and I put my name inside of it. And then this ring is from... Where did I get it from? I think I got it from the bay or something. Then this little heart ring. It's gold. I've had it since I was little. Then these four rings here I got in a set at spring. So this one has a rose and a pearl. Then the little bow that was in my monthly favorites. Um, some little crystals and more little crystals. Then I have some stud earrings. Um, soccer balls, love, bows. These ones are from Forever 21. Then I have the earring rack where I just have a bunch of miscellaneous earrings. A lot of these are um, really old and from Claire's, but the ones that are not from Claire's are, oops, these ones, they're from Hawaii. My neighbor brought them back for me. They're little um, flowers. Then these ones here are from American Eagle. Um, everything else is from Forever, uh, Claire's. Then these ones are from H&M. Um, no, the second one is hanging right here. I think it fell. Let me... Oh, I got a little tangled. Alright. Then, all these are from Claire's. Then, underneath here, again, Claire's. These ones are from Forever 21. These ones are from a random booth in the mall. And these ones are from Garage. But everything else is from Claire's. Like, when I was younger, I don't really wear a lot of these anymore because they're kind of junky. Oh, and these little hoops are from, like, a jewelry store. They're silver. Then, down here, I keep some bracelets. So, um, some of them are gifts, and I don't really know where they're from. But the ones that I do know are this cuff here. I got it from H&M. Let me focus in on this. It's really pretty from H&M. Then I got this one from Forever 21, and I like this one a lot. I wear it pretty often. This wrap one is from American Eagle. It's a watch. Then, moving down here, um, my aunt bought me this evil eye bracelet. I don't know if you guys have seen these evil eye bracelets before. Then, this one is from H&M. And does anyone remember these bracelets? <laughs> I have Italian flag, a pig, a dog, dance slippers, Piano, my name. That's really old. I don't really wear that anymore. But that's about it for my jewelry collection. So this is how I organize it in this um, little armoire that I got online. And I really like it. It matches my furniture. And it's honestly like a lifesaver. It keeps all my jewelry really organized. And um, it doesn't tarnish in here. So I really like this holder. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tour. I'm going to close it up. It also came with a key so you can lock it up, but I don't really do that because I go in there like almost every day to pick up my jewelry. So that's about it. I guess I can do a quick little outfit of the day. Um, up top I'm wearing this black top from H&M and it's a little bit edgy. It's like a distressed um, button up and then it has a leather pocket which I really like. And oh, I had it tucked into the front of my jeans, but it came untucked I guess when I um, was bending over and then my jeans are from Garage and I'm just wearing black socks. So that's about it for my outfit of the day and my jewelry collection. I hope you guys all enjoyed and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!